The overall goal of this procedure is to isolate high-quality RNA from serum samples using our optimized version of the common MRC tri-reagent RTLS protocol. This is accomplished by first diluting the serum in a 1 to 5 ratio with nuclease-free water to lower protein contamination. The second step is to introduce two milliliter phase lock tubes for the first centrifugation step. This traps the majority of contaminants, such as phenol and proteins, in the organic phase. Next, the third and final optimization step is the flash centrifugation spin at 12,000 Gs, which removes any residual contamination from the RNA pellet prior to the ethanol washes. The final step is to pool two modified RNA preparations from the same patient if a higher total RNA yield is required. Ultimately, by using this modified method, which solubilizes serum in nuclease-free water, employs a phase lock tube to trap major contaminants, and introduces a flash spin, we show that it is possible to maximize the recovery of small non-coding RNAs from an RNA isolation from serum. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, like the standard triazole RNA isolation protocol, is that through simple modifications, we can maximise the yield of RNA from serum. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because small RNAs are found in low quantities in serum. The optimised method and visualisation of these steps will improve recovery of these RNAs and guide novices to a successful isolation. To begin, thaw the previously prepared frozen serum sample on ice, then transfer 400 microns.